authorities in Mexico issuing an arrest warrant in the mysterious death of 25-year-old American tourist Shanquella Robinson. Local officials have not yet named the person, but they're calling them a direct aggressor against the Charlotte native and have initiated a request for extradition from the United States. In video that is too graphic to show, one of Robinson's acquaintances can be seen physically attacking her inside the room of the Cabo Resort where they were vacationing last month. According to local reports, on October 29th, one of the guests staying at the resort called for help around 2 p.m. Upon arriving, medical professionals were informed that Robinson had drunk a lot of alcohol. A doctor reportedly said she was stable but dehydrated, suggesting she may be treated at a hospital. The guests insisting she remain at the villa. A police report stating Robinson went into cardiac arrest and was declared deceased around 6 p.m. But those reports differing from an autopsy obtained by ABC News stating that medical professionals arrived at the villa around 3 p.m. and declared her dead within 15 minutes, citing that Robinson died from a severe spinal cord injury and a dislocated neck. But this to happen to her is just, just terrible, you know. I just couldn't believe it. It's like I'm still asleep, like a nightmare. After learning about the warrant, Robinson's mother telling ABC News they had been waiting for someone to finally be held accountable and arrested, adding that she just can't wait for justice to be served. The FBI is also conducting their own investigation. Victor Okendo, ABC News, Miami.